least I still have enough money to buy the Ryan or the Sabertooth skin. Yeah. Um. Yeah. Let's go to the next track, I guess. We still have a few new ones left to go through. Let's just go then. I don't think so. You're not gonna get me that easily. Okay, run away. Run! Run! Um, oh. oh. Not gonna get me. You're not gonna get me this time, Snowpile. Don't even think about it. Stupid voice crack. Good lord. Um, okay. Fire! Fire! Fire the seeker. Seeker ammo. The seekers. Yeah. Pretty awkward. Um, I'm not sure if that was awkward or not, but maybe it was. <laughs> Whatever. Um, let's see. More boring ways to go over here. Eh, whatever. That exciting last slap. Mm. Seriously, at this point, I just I just ran out of things to say. Um, yeah, some final recording distance. Jeez, I pretty much had an alright start at the beginning, talking about all kinds of stuff and rambling. But now I just ran out of things to say, and now I'm talking about almost nothing. I'm just rambling and just saying random stuff once again. And making no sense. Probably. Oh man. Ooh, this track looks pretty confusing right here. Like on one part it's really long, and in the other part it looks really twisty with the turns. Jeez, this track looks pretty big. Yeah, but I should have bought more equipment for this. Um for this ride, I don't know. Well, maybe I wasn't, weren't, able, weren't able to to buy a bit more at this point. I, I don't know. I pretty much made one. I pretty much made the best decisions that I can. Oh, what the hell? Did I mess up the turn right there? Hopefully, yeah. Good thing that still counts. Thank God! Ugh, okay. But I'm still last! Come on, I need to keep up. I need to catch up. I'm not gonna fail. I'm not gonna fail. Come now. Come on now. What is it gonna be? I just put down those mines right there because I don't care. At least, at least catch up to the guys right here, dude. Come on now. Jeez. Those guys don't go up that easily now, do they? There we go. That's a lot better. Come on, catch up. Yes. Goodness. Don't mess up to jump right there. Um, just keep going, man. Whoa, 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 whoa. At least I finished second, so that's good. <coughs> Take that, put your eyes bone. You ain't getting me that, that easily. I ain't giving up that easily. Oh, my. I think we completed all the stages on um, on this division. Now we just now, well, yeah, repeating the um, repeating the same tracks and yeah. I'm not sure if I want to cut a little bit on this part because really, I don't know. I kind of ran out of things to say at this point. At least interesting things to say. So I think I'm just gonna cut to. 
Well, maybe not right away. I'm gonna cut to mm, to when I get the points that I need to finish this planet. But mm, I'm thinking I'm actually even in some parts that are interesting to watch, or at least funny moments, or just interesting moments, or maybe like funny moments for my commentary or things that I would like to talk about uh, on things that are on my mind. So. Yeah, I gotta cut a little bit at this point, so... Yeah, let's do this. Oh, some weird sounds at the background right there. There was one that go like... Or... Or whatever that was, jeez. Now I'm making my dumb noises over here. Ooh, body slam. Party check! <laughs> First... <laughs> what should I buy over here? Maybe more bombs and another bo bottle. Damn it, I don't have enough. Wait, actually, I think you do actually have a break. One, it's actually if you like if you press down, you can actually break like right here. Yeah, huh. never noticed that before. <laughs> That's kind of a surprise right there. So there actually is a breaking button at, over here, and I got him first again. And ooh, actually have enough points to actually proc his food through a little bit. Um, well, really, there's no point of buying that, but still, I'm just gonna buy it for the sake of buying it. Yeah, yeah, I'll shut up if you want. Or probably not. I'm stretching! Never left it off! I don't know why I said that. Whoa, don't drop your controller, dude. And as you notice over here, there's music playing this time in the background while you're flying. That means that you pretty much finished the game over here. Now, now which planet are you going at this time? Your, the next plan that you're going is, is, come on game, faster, Earth. Yes, you're actually going into Earth. And this actually looks really cool over here. Now, the ship is going down now, and what the scenery looks like when you're landing, it looks really futuristic and modern right here. Yeah, quite a lot of skyscrapers over here. This is pretty much like the landing point over here, man. Looks really cool, I'm not gonna lie. It has all of those beams on the ground, it has like all those things for the for the landing and smiley face, welcome to something. I didn't read that all of the things. Yeah, it looked really modern right there. Well, I guess this game pretty much takes place in the future. Whoa, look at it. Look at that body of that guy on, on my character, Tarquin. Welcome to the Rock and Roll Racing Hall of Heroes. And yeah, it looks like the, that alien, that green alien, learns, in, learns English pretty well. Congratulations to this year's winner of the Indy Super Cup. The Indy Super Cup? <laughs> okay. And now for some highlights from this year's Rock and Roll season. Yeah, let's check it out, shall we? I've never seen like with the character Tar Tarquin when I finish when I finish the game. So that's that looks pretty unique. Yeah, the I'm not sure if the oh this time this time the ending right here has the commentator in the background. While experiencing uh, while talking about the racers. This actually I don't I personally don't think this that the Andy changes at, at in the game. I think i when I beat beat this game recently, uh, right now that I see it, I don't think they're really changed. So yeah. Pretty unique. Right here. The game doesn't really copy everything you did from the game for about the for the ending. If they actually did that, 
or at least if, or at least the game that actually did it, that would have been, or at least the game did it. But uh, I'm really messing up my voice over here. If they if they did that right there, and copied the, what everything you did in the game and put it into the end, that would have been really cool. Yeah, now for some metal crunching on Bogmire. Yeah, the third planet. Let's see what kind of highlight they show over here. And yeah, I didn't, I never picked up this car, the car, and yeah, I guess you now have a chance to actually see it how it looks like with this color of the of the car. You, you finally finally see how it looks like in the game. So yeah, pretty cool. Yeah, that was, that was pretty close on the on the finish right there. And some firing action on New Mojab or. Oh yeah, or whatever this is. My my commentator doesn't know the word, so and now I just randomly talking. Now I'm just randomly seeing up what what it looks like, what what it says for the player. Roadkill is about the background. Tarquin launches himself. Yeah, I'm just I'm a little Roadkill quiet over here. Man, what the hell, man? Go for it. Get him in close finish. Ooh. This clip from NHO should get your wheels rolling on the ice. Cool. I say cool. Um, let's see what kind of highlight this could be. I'm not sure. There's one more. Um, there's one more. Clip. If you if you if you finish this game on Warrior, there's gonna be there's also gonna be one more clip on the on the final on the final planet, which I think if I remember correctly, it's called Inferno. I'm pretty sure. So yeah, another extra ending right here, right there. About it. Yeah, quite a close finish. Another close finish right there. Thank you for joining us today. You're welcome, sir. Alien, sir. And what's next? Tonight's event has been brought to you by Viking All Beep Cola. Sponsor! Well, I don't know if that actually exists in real life, but yeah, I don't know. So thick, you have to drink it with a fork. How could you drink something with a fork? Well, I guess you could use a fork to actually get the meat out, I guess, and just use it right there. Maybe that meat tastes like soda or cola or whatever. Yeah. That would be a little weird to actually eat meat that tastes like cola, but whatever. It would be pretty cool. It's like, what if it's like a Coca-Cola bottle? It's like with a really thin, like, like a really thin diameter, like for the hole. Like for getting inside of the bottle, like that the fork wouldn't actually fit, and you wouldn't get the the beef out. It's like you have to break the bottle to actually get it out. It's like jeez, better use like a might as well just use like a cylinder, like some sort of really big cylinder bottle to actually get out the meat and drink the coke. I don't know. That's that's what I think. So that's pretty much the end of rock and roll racing, guys. Or rock and roll racing, guys. I don't know. It, it was pretty good. It, I had some fun with this one a little bit. At the end, well, during this recording, I didn't have as much fun as I thought it would. But hey, whatever. I still kind of enjoyed it in some parts. But yeah, I guess it turned out pretty good for this game. And the voice in the game, the commentary. Larry Supermel Puffman. <laughs> nice name right there. I don't know if that name really exists in real life. If it did, if it does, that uh, awesome name, man. Awesome. I don't know if he's watching this video, but if you are, awesome name, dude. What awesome name? Yeah. Whatever. Um. I guess at this point, I could, I, I can make an announcement over here. Uh, a short announcement. Um. I'm gonna. I'm gonna save up. I'm gonna stop making Sega Genesis Let's Play for a while. Well, for a little while at this point. Um, I'm gonna focus. Um, 
the reason why is because I want to focus a little bit more on out the bonus videos on Honest Man's Returns, and really, like, during the making of the Let's Plays, I really, I really don't really have the time to actually make any, I don't really have enough time to make the bonus videos, or, or I would say a little bit motivation to make the bonus videos, because, I don't know, I just, I don't know, it's just, it's just something that I feel that it does it. It's like I wanted to more focus on the last press right on, on the bonus video. So I think I'm gonna, um, gotta stop the making the, um, the last play videos on a while, for a while and try to focus as much as I can on the bonus videos just to, you know, complete Alice Man's returns. So that's pretty much the end of rock and roll race right there, guys. I pretty much said that the second second time right there. That's just, this is pretty much the end of screw right there. You can't really like do anything. You can't really press anything. You're pretty much stuck at this point on the enemy. And being I'm pretty much pressing every button over here and nothing happens. You're pretty much gonna be stuck on this screen right here. So I hopefully you enjoyed this let's play and yeah, I guess that's pretty much it. This has been Opera Ninja 7 8, and I'll see you guys on the bonus videos on Ash Minutes and Returns and on the last Sega Genesis game that I'm gonna be less playing on the row. So, yeah. See you guys later.